what can really help with my PMDD, right? I've worked with a lot of women that have been diagnosed with PMDD or even consider that maybe this is something that I have. PMDD is essentially a type of PMS that is really, really bad. You can have extreme mood swings, extreme pain, um, extreme anxiety, depression, symptoms like that, that kind of come out of nowhere and really debilitate you from living your normal life. And it's for a temporary period of time, but it still can be excruciating to go through month after month after month. And when we're looking at how to help this, how to deal with this, one of the things to realize is that inflammation plays a big role in how your hormones function and the negative impact of them when they're imbalanced. So first thing, things that can help with this, taking down the inflammation, decreasing inflammation in your system. And this is something we help you navigate and tell you specifically how to do in the 12 week program, right? The 12 week female hormone solution program. So you can go below this video, learn more about that, get on the wait list for the next program that we launch because you're not gonna wanna miss out getting your own Dutch test, hormone test, as well as custom recommendations based on what your system needs to accomplish your results as quickly as possible. So decreasing inflammation, decreasing stress, that's another thing. Stress increases inflammation. Stress also makes that hormonal imbalance worse. Um, improving your sleep, right? As well as getting your hormones balanced. How do I balance my hormones? There's a lot of different ways that we do this. Again, what I typically recommend for people is based on your hormone report specifically, but there are tinctures that can really help your system become more balanced overall because it supports the natural production and maintenance of estrogen and progesterone. And that is the estro balance and progesterone balance, which you can find on my website for those tinctures. Now, the other thing that is really helpful for managing this issue, PMDD, overall is making sure that you're adjusting your lifestyle while you're working through these things. It is really, really tough if you are just trying to like plow ahead and continue on and not give your body the break it might need as it's working through these issues, right? If you know that mm, this certain week throughout the month, it's a tougher week, mm, do everything you can to lighten up your calendar. Don't schedule as many appointments, don't schedule as much with work, you know, make sure you can rest as much as possible. Again, take down that inflammation. Um, I have women where that have a lot of success because they are able to get their system through this process and not stress their body out more because they will do things like meal prep for that time frame. Set up extra support systems, have friends bring them food, you know, um, get some help, you know, cleaning their house or doing their laundry or something like that. So they don't have as many daily tasks to, compl to complete at that time because it's hard to keep up with your life when you feel like absolute garbage. It's hard to continue with everything that you normally do when your body isn't functioning the way that it normally does. So having help, getting assistance is essential. And it also takes a little bit of the mental pressure off because not only do you just not feel good, right? But then mentally you sort of have this guilt of, oh, I'm getting this, you know, this far behind on my daily chores at home or I'm missing this or that, right? So it can be a really tough thing mentally to go through, but this is a great way to sort of navigate that to give yourself, um, I'll say a break. <laughs> and give your system um, and give your brain a little bit of grace because you've got somebody to help you out, right? Delegate it. You don't have to do everything yourself, right? And that way you can go through this process while you're applying all these other things, while you're decreasing your inflammation. And this is going to help decrease stress. So hopefully you can work through this and have big improvements overall. And maybe instead of it being a week that you're down and out, it jumps to five days, four days, and then maybe only a day or two where you're having some issues and, and you're able to just live your life overall a lot better. So I am Dr. Beth Westy, women's health and hormone expert, author of the books, The Female Fat Solution and The Female Menopause Solution, host of the podcast, The Female Health Solution. I would love, love, love your feedback with just applying some of these tips if you have tried them to help with PMDD. And if you need more help, make sure you go below this video, get on the wait list for the next 12 week program. We dive into your hormone report and make sure we are applying customized things that are gonna help you get the best results possible for your system as quickly as you can.